guys, welcome to another episode of Daytime Noir Show. I just got done watch the Law Arising, or Law Boy Arising, is what I call it. But um, this episode was actually boring. But then again, we finally got past that point in that arc that they put the kids in for no apparent reason because they didn't actually accomplish anything besides find out that Suzune could touch many people with her music and actually make people. So I was singing a new song that they wasn't accustomed to due to the fact that their world only had, I believe, 42. Now they got 43 now. The fight ended out of nowhere. The, all the rivals disappeared. Now I try to uh, deliver in a message that there was going to be a war pretty soon, which is getting me a little excited. And have a little glimpse of hope that this anime could return to it's first five episodes of season one that I loved. And not to mention the first half of this season that I actually loved as well. Hopefully they could actually... I can see your foot, like, literally in the camera right now. Okay, like, move over a little bit. But anyway, um, hopefully they could, um, you know, return to their glory and actually do this adaptation right because it's literally it's law boy rising right now. It's like how fairy tale is filler tale and how Naruto is Naruto Ultimate Fairy Chronicles right now. We're gonna eventually return to the great of these animes one day. But another thing that got me pondering is who is Row Two? Is she really have something to do with Zero due to the fact that she is technically dressed just like him? So hopefully they will disclose that in the final few episodes of Log Horizon. But anyway, tell you guys stay. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for supporting my channel. Peace out.